guys. Welcome to our channel. Civil Engineering Guru. Hope you all are fine. As you all know that in previous video. We have discussed triangulation. Today our topic is. Triangulation figures and layouts. Triangulation figures and layouts. The basic figures. Used in triangulation networks. Are the triangle. Braced or geodetic quadrilateral and the polygon with a central station. The triangles in a triangulation system can be arranged in a number of ways. Some of the commonly used arrangements, also called layouts, are as follows. Single chain of triangles. Double chain of triangles. Braced quadrilaterals. Centered triangles and polygons. A combination of above systems. Single chain of triangles. When the control points are required to be established in a narrow strip of terrain such as a valley between ridges, a layout consisting of single chain of triangles is generally used as shown in figure. This system is rapid and economical due to its simplicity of citing only four other stations and does not involve observations of long diagonals. On the other hand, Simple triangles of a triangulation system provide only one route through which distances can be computed, and hence, this system does not provide any check on the accuracy of observations, check baselines and astronomical observations, for azimuths have to be provided at frequent intervals to avoid excessive accumulation of errors in this layout. Double chain of triangles. A layout of double chain of triangles as shown in figure. This arrangement is used for covering the larger width of a belt. This system also has disadvantages of single chain of triangles system, braced quadrilaterals. A triangulation system consisting of figures containing four corner stations and observed diagonals as shown in figure is known as a layout of braced quadrilaterals. In fact, Braced quadrilateral consists of overlapping triangles. This system is treated to be the strongest and the best arrangement of triangles, and it provides a means of computing the lengths of the sides using different combinations of sides and angles. Most of the triangulation systems use this arrangement, centered triangles and polygons. A triangulation system which consists of figures containing interior stations, in triangle and polygon, as shown in figure is known as centered triangles, and polygons. This layout in a triangulation system, is generally used when vast area in all directions is required to be covered. The centered figures generally, are quadrilaterals, pentagons, or hexagons with central stations. Though this system provides checks on the accuracy, of the work. Generally it is not as strong as the braced quadrilateral arrangement. Moreover, the progress of work is quite slow due to the fact that more settings of the instrument are required. Combination of all above systems. Sometimes, a combination of above systems may be used, which may be according to the shape of the area and the accuracy requirements. If you guys like our today's video, then like comment our video and subscribe our channel civil engineering guru thank you bye